M0FXB, welcome to my channel. We're going to put a 6 meter repeater into my ICOM 705. First thing we'll do is we'll make sure we're in VFO mode. So you can tap here, click VFO. So we are in VFO mode. Then we'll select the band, tap the screen, tap the 7, look, and then we'll go to 50 megahertz. Then we're going to type in the frequency or we'll tune in the frequency. And we could tap this and actually type it in. Let's try that. Uh, enter like so we'll go five zero dot uh, zero seven seven zero am I making mistakes here let's do that again enter five zero dot seven seven zero 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 that's the one enter so that's our frequency then we want fm tap here fm now we're going to need to put in our shift so we tap function here i know i know this is different than the 7300 but i don't have the 7300 anymore so i've got to do it on the 705 so it's function and in this menu, go to number two, and you've got duplex here. And we want a pretty sure it's a plus shift for uh, GB3FH. And if we hold our finger on it, this will be the same with the 7300. Look, you can choose the megahertz, and it's telling you here what the output frequency will be. So let's have a look here. Uh, yeah, that's correct. 51.270. So that's when you when you transmit, that's what you're going to be doing. So that all looks fine. So if we keyed the mic now, that will be the correct, correct shift. But first of all, we're going to check our tone frequency, which needs to be 77. So we're going to go function again, go number one, uh, turn on the tone for one. I think it's tone squelch on that repeater. Hold our finger on it as well, and then change the tone squelch to... 77 that's it all done 77 so back out just go exit and just quickly show the tx look so that's good so we've got everything in there now all we need to do now is save it to our memory so next thing you do is tap and hold the vfo thing here go to mw and hold it Turn it up so we can hear it should beep. See, and it's now in there on channel zero one. So that's it. So if you go to memo with a bit of luck, we change channels to one. It should be there, depending on which group we put it in. Oh, there it is there, zero one. And that's it. So that's how you add it into your memory channel. So I hope that helps you set up your six meter repeater. Seven three for now, all the best.